Okay, so your browser has been hijacked by this fee.helperbar.com. I'm going to show you how to remove it manually. You don't have to download any other junk onto your computer. And I'm going to show you on Google Chrome. However, it's the same steps for, it's almost the same steps for Mozilla Firefox and IE. However, if you want the exact same steps for IE and Mozilla Firefox, click on the link below. However, first thing you want to do before anything is you need to go into your control panel. And this could be a little bit tricky here. So go into your control panel. Add remove programs. Okay, now this could be a little bit tricky because we have to uninstall the program, and it could be under any of these names. It could be under Feed Helper, Feed Helper. It could be Snap, Snap to Default, Default Searches. So if you guys, all this is going to be on the bottom in the description. So if you guys see if any of these words in here that relate to any of your programs in here, and you're not familiar with it get rid of it, uninstall it. Chances are it's junk, it's probably more junk, uh, additional junk you didn't even know you had on there. And that's causing your your, uh, your PC or your computer to slow down. So if you have any of these, uninstall it. Now, next step, open up Google Chrome, top right hand corner, click on there, and then we want to go to settings. Four places we want to look in here. First place is on startup. You want to click on set pages. And if you see that feed help bar uh, in here, dot com, just go ahead and exit out. If there's something else in here you don't know what it is, maybe it's the snap do, whatever, you don't, if you're not familiar with it, highlight it, click on X, get rid of it. Next, next place, under appearance, you want to click on change. If you find that help bar in here, get rid of it. Same thing, if you, if you see Snap doing here as well, because they're both like interlinked, get rid of it. Next place, and most a lot of you guys are going to have it under here. Let me zoom in here. Manage search engines. If you see that uh, helpbar.com in here, get rid of it. Also down here, helpbar.com, just highlight it, click on the X. Anything else you guys are not familiar with, highlight it, click on the X. I mean, you might have that Snap Do in here that's uh, interlinked with that helpbar.com. And to make your uh, defaults, uh, mine's on Yahoo. If you want to make it on like Google, just highlight it and click on Make Default, and it'll become bold like that. Last but not least, we're going to same page. We're going to scroll all the way down to the very bottom. We're going to click on Show Advanced Settings, and we're going to scroll all the way down to the very very bottom. And it says Reset Browser Settings. Now take note. Once we reset the browser setting, guys, you will lose everything. All of your saved passwords, your cookies, your temp files, your bookmarks, your favorites. It's all going to be long gone. Anyways, we set it. Close and reopen Firefox or close and reopen Chrome, and you guys should be good to go. However, some of you guys may have your shortcut in the wrong, to, uh, pointing in the wrong path. So, for instance what you need to do is like for instance my, my Google Chrome shortcut is on my desktop I'm gonna go right here I'm gonna right click I'm gonna go to properties right click and now you guys have to make sure your path is right we could have done all those steps but yet your shortcut path your target is still in the wrong spot make sure it's a dot or a chrome.exe or iExplorer.exe or firefox.exe you guys have questions just comment below thanks and have a good day you guys bye